So the Hirschkind kind of bacteria is an obligate aerobe, which means that it grows best in oxygen environments, like at the top of the test tube, because it cannot ferment anaerobically. And an example of this is Nocaria steroids. So another kind of bacteria would be an aerotolerant anaerobe. And with an aerotolerant anaerobe, it can grow in the presence of oxygen or without oxygen. And an example would be E. coli. Now, that's why I have the bacteria growing not only in the oxygen zone or without oxygen, but it's spread throughout the tube. All right, the next kind of bacteria is microaerophile. So it needs oxygen to grow, but at high concentrations, it's poisonous. So in a test tube, you can see the bacteria growing at the top of the test tube, but not the very top. Uh, a good example is Helicobacter pylori. This is strict anaerobe, which is oxygen toxic. The bacteria grow away from the O2 zone at the bottom of the tube. And an example of this would be Bacteroides fragilis. Another type of bacteria is a facultative anaerobe, which means that the bacteria can grow either with oxygen or without oxygen, but it prefers to grow with oxygen. And an example of this kind of bacteria is Streptococcus thermophilus. Thank you.